only recorded yesterday and I already don't remember what my last stop and point and goal was. Um, hmm. Let's check. Right, I was thinking about seizing trade pools from other trade republics such as Pisa or Venice. Now, Venice, I think, is a bit weaker currently. They have almost no gold and have less troops than us. But I was also thinking while I was ending uh, last time I was playing about actually expanding the realm a bit. Just going about it. Could press our de jour claim before it falls apart. And get this back into the fold. I think we should. They don't have any allies. Could we get Denmark? No. Could we get Sweden? And we get the Holy Roman Empire maybe, or one of these kings down here. We could just swear fealty, right? No, I don't want that either. Hungary? You're far away. See, Lithuania. These are probably not willing to betroth with us. Ah. Infidels. Novograd. Really no one around. So, financially speaking, we're in a decent position to deal with this. So let us. Has been a long time coming, Norway. Just a matter of time. We're losing 18 gold, meaning we still have around 40 left. For some mercenaries, and I think we're going to go immediately with that. I wish I could set like a favorite here. Where are the Pechengs? There they are. Oh! 34. I mean, we can afford it. And they are by far the best thing we could get. So we will send our own troops to split up back here and we send the mercenaries to Westfold to deal with that and we leave our retinue at home to defend. How are we at war with this? No idea where that was blinking. How many troops did you have? 9,000. Okay. I suppose... Um, how do you have 9,000? Let's see. Hired. Okay, she got some mercenaries as well. He's there. They're going somewhere there. Let's keep our army together for now. Don't want any surprises here. They're probably getting on boats. Are we not already stressed? No, right now we're not. Since we are master seducer, let's break up with the ones that have husbands that are alive. Tina. Yeah, I see boats, I see movement. This army is going to tell us where they're going. Already we lost 2,000 troops to attrition. Yeah, I see a whole bunch of boats. They are coming for our capital. And we lost 5,000 to attrition. 4,000. That wasn't smart. <laughs> I 
I mean, I would say at least they suffer the same, but they're not. They're not suffering the same. They're ferrying their troops around. And how are we not catching these? Okay, we just ran into 8,000 troops. They were 2,000 before, but they are now 8,000. Let's see if our retinue can arrive before we lose it. Nope. Yeah, that was terrible. Get our retinue back home before he jumps on the opportunity to take us out here. And a dangerous faction pops up, obviously. Of course they do. Um... How do you have 93% of my men? Let's do a demonic possession on him. So he loves us. And also raise their troops maybe. If you got men to oppose me, okay apparently you have men to oppose me but not men to support me. How exactly do you have 90% what? From what? Alright, let's get some more mercenaries in this. Sadly, we can't do a holy order because these are definitely not infidels, sadly. Sadly, sadly, sadly. Let's get these here. How much money do we lose? 39. Okay. We could get the Swiss company. Ooh, yeah. Lots of pike. We saw the Breton company. I feel Swiss fits our army composition a bit better. Again, I don't want to use my retinue if I can avoid it at all. Where are you going? There. And where is Norway going with their troops? Probably back to a ship. Okay, we're going to do something I haven't done in a while. We're going to send our spy out here to go give us some much needed insight on what they're doing. Ah, they're sieging. Very good. And they're sieging, they're not running to places I can't see them. Get some good commanders in here. Okay, let's find some good commanders to get in there. Search everywhere. 25, yes, please. And heavy foot. Cavalry leader, a very young one too. I don't care so much for light foot because I don't have all that much of it. And an aggressive leader, oh yeah. Flanking. Ah, there's a siege guy. Let's get the siege guy. Always nice to have a siege guy. What we could do with our retinue is attack the smaller issues. But then I am leaving myself far open for attack. Okay, we're not going to do that. We'll just deal with it like this then. Right, and we have two commander slots open anyway, which is fantastic. There's a whole bunch of the lower ranked ones. Let's get these troops also led. And we imprison. One of importance. Yeah, yeah, I'm losing. He's sieging me back here. Nothing much I can do about that. A 
Okay, so we are attacking in an unfavorable position. But we do have a lot of force. That should count for something. Having invested myself lately in this literary endeavor, okay. One percent of dying. Full party with the troops a bit. Uh, come on, we can do it. Yes, made it. Let's take their capital. Siege master control. And hope that they... Oh no, how much attrition? 20% severe winter. That's not good. We are going to lose heavily. We have to move away from here. What is this host doing here anyway? They're not helping anything. Okay, let's run around with our troops a bit. At least it means we lose less money. Because if everyone constantly dies... We should probably... I want to keep beating this army here. But I also kind of need to take care of this stuff. Okay, let, let us send our retinue. I don't think he has more troops than this. This will, however, financially impact us quite severely. He's probably going to go back sieging in Telemark. Oh no. Ah, these are holy orders. He got the holy order and he, that's not going to help him. They're not going to fight. He's going to come attack me. I'll take that fight. See? Holy Order is not involved in this whatsoever. We're breaking one flank already. Had some shield wall tactics in there. Okay, just based on battles, we're completely winning this. And we're out of winter too, so uh, let's try and finish the siege before winter ends. And this guy is going over to this guy again. Okay, you know what we're going to do? We're just going to siege here. Where it's all about. He's just following the horse around. I don't care. I don't want to start a vendetta against some weirdo. Okay, you know what they're doing? Probably they're going to come here. It's probably what they're going to do. That's... Uh, we're also opening ourselves up in a huge manner to this army. We need to finish this siege and move our troops. Right. Siege is finished. Let's move our troops. Follow the Norwegians. And maybe cut off this advancing army need to be a bit careful with our retinue if they are not coming for my homeland I don't know where they're going I swear they're coming from my homeland okay these are mainly horses so 
Oh, no, it's mainly light infantry. Interesting. Well, good. Then my army should have no trouble dealing with that. They're just sieging through my stuff there. Let's check our technology. What can we do? Ooh, covered array. But I'd rather go for more infantry. Morale is just king. Uh, since we're not sieging right now, let's put him here in charge. We have to start sieging this, otherwise we're not going to win it. And we have taken... Taken care! Taken care of that... Little band. What happened to our... Ayo up here. Are you a loyal servant? Yes, he is. So, it looks like he has 7,000 troops. In reality, it doesn't. Because the 2,000 here do nothing for him in this battle against us, anyway. Financially, we're still doing well enough. And not a lot of troops, so we can siege these down and retake them immediately. So now let's go take stuff here. We're also going to split this army. Siege more stuff. Maybe he'll come back. Try to deal with us. Feels very wrong to leave our home open like this. Let's start reading a book. Upgrade the garrison size of our city. Um, Levy and garrison size, yeah. Need a new court chaplain. And everyone kind of hates us who is capable of doing it. We'll convert the heathens in the in the hinterlands of this great country. Okay, so he's turning around. And he's probably going to look for a fight. Let's put these here so we have a triangle and can quickly support all armies as required. Okay, he's attacking here, so... Our flank is in here. I will reinforce this army once these sieges are done. And he is set to... Yep. Now we come in. And these guys get the siege master real quick. Stressed. Let's move everyone in on this. Not taking any chances here. Getting reinforcements does help replenish flanks that might be broken already. That's pretty neat. This guy gets the siege master and we'll split up again. We've pretty much won this now. 
We have won all but one battle. Which was an important battle. Don't you get me wrong. Ooh, look at him. Georg Arneson. Military mind of the family. Financially speaking, we could probably stand down one of our mercenary bands. But why would we? Because, of course, what I feared would happen did happen. 189 troops. Okay, we need to stand these down. So we can raise them up here again. And take care of these. Before they can actually break through. See the attackers just dwindle away. And we can still maintain our sieges out here with our retinue and the mercenaries. Ooh, more majesty, more, more popular customs. I feel like forcing the cities to like us is kind of kind of neat, but I'd rather have I don't know if any of this really means anything for a republic later. Let's go for more majesty. Norwegians are sieging one of our family's trade posts. Our troops stand vigil. Find these two. Oh, he broke off. No, nope, he didn't break off. He did defeat Boberg. Family. Yeah, we're losing money because we're replenishing our uh, retinue. Let's get these together here. Out there. Then split off our retinue, bring the retinue back home. What are we losing? We're not... Okay. I was just about to say, we're not losing a lot. Um, yeah, we're losing a whole bunch. Not sure why that is. Okay, we'll let him come and engage as he crosses... we go all right our book is done um have an orgy where we're probably going to oh we lost the trade frail again oh, okay i can live with that um let's check our book Ooh. vassal opinion plus five leisure opinion plus 15 don't need that Intrigue plus one, stewardship plus one. Okay, that's not bad. Keeping Merchant Republic Court. Pretty cool. This star foul impulses. Ah, oh, we have one. I don't need to finish this battle. Okay, immediately stand on everything that costs us money. And return to only paying our retinue. Bring them home to defend. So now this is back where it belongs in our hand. Do we hold this duchy title? No.
there's a defensive pact against this. Crazy. Okay. Uh, now that we have done the war thing, time to focus on home again. The growing up fast, and despite having a club foot, you will be a decent martial leader. How are you turning out? Not very spectacularly. How about this kid? Not much happening there either. But we have a whole bunch of girls who don't do much. Never even set these, wow. I am a terrible father. This one I've set. The King of England. Let us. Finish English Alliance. How how does that sound to you guys? Ow. Into the Oblietti goals? Well, at least it's a non-aggression pack. Not that we really need it, but... Let's see who else we can get. The Duke of Finland. Oh, you know what? Why not just get some blood at home as well? Some non-aggression packs going like that. She is not within my range, so I can't do anything about her. Oh, she's strong. <coughs> Eberhard von Thüringen. Sure. The alliance. Are you good anyway? 1,500, I mean... It's something. Not much, but something. Check the rest of our girls. Strong one. Duke of Minsk. Check through the Holy Roman Empire. Bohemia, would you like one of my princes? No. Would you like one of my princesses, sis? Yes. Very good. Let's play this house real quick. We've broken up with one of our lovers because she took another lover. There we go. King of Bohemia. Alliance. Do you have a princesses? No. There are very few princesses, it looks like. And we don't have any princesses anymore either. Papacy. Do you have a princesses? Oh, yeah, you have. It's 500 gold. Oh, he's not going to accept it anyway. Right. So what else to do? 1,700 and something. That's not much, my friend in Sweden. Who's the antipope? Piety, moral authority. What is Kami anyway? And why do we have a... Did you reclaim on that? I think we should take Finland. Press the kiddos claim. Not like they can't do anything about it right now. Eh. 
Let's press this. For the kid. I took that. And it's Finland. We are Finland. I mean, it's in the name. It's right there. Let's raise just our troops. Should be enough. 2,830. That's 5,000, not 2,830. More. We like more. First seek battle with their army. Yep. Stop giving us the run around. And then fight. Ah, goody. They're trying to siege something back from someone. Okay, we're crossing a river and we're going into the forest. Not ideal, but I have trust in my people. And level up here, so we shall. Okay, I think when they turn yellow, it's pure suit. Now let's go take Finland. Consolidating the realm a little bit here in the north. Like us well enough, don't you? That's a goldsmith woman. That family still exists. Are we killing anyone right now? Yeah. That's not going too well, it looks like. Another little Swedish army. Oh, that was his full army. Not the little Swedish army. That was the full army. We could get our retinue to just siege here. They get the Siege Master, the Retinue get the Master Master. He is spreading lies about us. Let's seduce her daughter for that. I think it's only fair. On meet us by the stream and we can use the master seducer version having her immediately seduced and now we kill that woman here Let's expose the affair and turn our gaze towards some trade posts too. Trade post of Sieland. And Orland. And Östergötland. And just. And that's it for now. We'll need money to pay our troops and stuff. I don't like going too low. If he even looks like going south, we will jump with our retinue. Why do we only have 6% holding the thing this is about? But our new lover is immediately pregnant too.
Give them the siege master now. And these get the good guy again. One here needing some ching. Let's go for learning. It's not ideal, but I mean, if if it's already kind of where it goes with the kid, then why not? What is plot is, but I want it ended. What did you claims? Can we still press? Well, this is just one thing. Good. We will de jure press against them. Why are they not stopping? To turn around. Anna gets a strong claim on the city of Venezia. Wouldn't that be something? And we're still young enough to press it too. I think I'll use this. Clearly. Clearly we have a claim. Who or what would make you think we didn't? Send our troops here so we can siege while also making sure he doesn't do some weird crossing. Ah, someone died. Or chaplain. You don't like us. Go deal with the heathens out in the hinterlands. Ladies fleeing from our attempts, okay. Then we turn back to the families. Taking his capital. Also go here so he doesn't get any ideas about crossing over here. Oh, Kimi is up here. This guy died. A new family has risen. Let's try killing this guy again. Or oh, you know what? We can just sacrifice him to Satan. And we can try kill this guy. Again, I want to just push as many trade posts into our possession as possible. And that is by redistributing them after a new family arises. Oh no, we become ugly. Oh no, we... No, we are ugly. <laughs> Game just didn't update. Let's expose everyone who needs expositions. State Inquisitor, this guy. Court Physician. Die, our kinsman. All right, and that pushed a bunch of new trade posts into our hands. How do the trade posts look now? And we mean we control most. Ragde, the family here. Still hoping that this guy is going to start families and trade posts and whatnot. But I don't think that's how it works. Are we called the Lecce? I mean, it's kind of fair.
I wonder why this is taking so long. Are we fighting for more than just that? I don't think so. Now attacking Venice is going to be very, very interesting indeed. Very interesting indeed. Okay, let's recall our... Brother? No, our kinsman. Um... I wish it would tell us more, it, like cousin, second cousin, something like that. That would be really cool. Kinsman is so... A cousin is already still, you know, close enough. Let's see what we can produce in Sweden, eh? Maybe we get something good out of that. Is the grand city of Venice anyway? Is it the whole thing? Oh cool! Instead of getting frail, we have become brawny, which is a fantastic thing to have. Plus one health. We suffer a little bit from magical corruption. That's okay. And we become cruel. Not super surprising. Okay, we're done with Finland. We've finally consolidated our power again. Bring home our troops. Sweden can do something else with its life again. You want this courtier? Or have her. Do we still have alliances? Well, one at least. Oh, look who wants an alliance all of a sudden. Let's do it. Pretty strong. Land down these troops. And now, for the coup d'etat, on the next one, let us assault Venezia. Stay around. 